As the temperature drops outside, it means it's time to start moving those flowers inside. Kendall Merrim with Bell Nursery joins us this morning to discuss the perfect indoor flower options. And I think I should say, hello, I'm right here. We're right. This is gorgeous. I mean, truly, what are those flowers that we do definitely want to bring inside, though? Well, any of your tropical plants. Um, hibiscus, if you're looking for your outdoor flowering tropicals. Um, croton, a lot of people put outside this time of year to get the color. Um, so any, anything that's tropical foliage. And what about, I mean, as far as like the, the potting and everything like that, what do we need to do as far as watering them, keeping them in the sun, overall speaking? Well, generally, if you're bringing one from outside, water it really well and make sure that you flush out all the salts and any bugs that might be residing oh, in the soil uh -huh. and uh, give them a day or two to, to dry out. And then once you bring them inside, um, put them in a sunny location, give them a little chance to adjust and then just don't overwater them as you go through the winter. And you're big on the overwatering because I've done many segments <laughs> with you and you always say, D make sure it's just a little bit each time. Yep. And even with like, I have these outside right now, they look gorgeous outside. When is like the time to bring them in? Well, it's good time now to start prepping because you definitely want to bring them in before our first full frost and you want to give them a week or two to start adapting as you move them closer to the house um, give them a little bit of time again once you bring them inside in that sunny window that's going to get a little less sunny as the season goes along so now's a really good time to be thinking about it and does anything work best like throughout the season now like as far as the green I mean, is there one if you want a flower to last it's the one you want for outdoors, um, a pansy is really mm -hmm. the way to go. But for indoors, obviously, we have um, lots of options that we're trying to bring some fall color in into the home so that when you're decorating at fall, it's not just um, tchotchkes and, and mm -hmm. items like that, but you can really use some of these plants for color and, and for interest, light. yeah. And the other thing too is that they're bright colors now. Like they're not just like the, you know, the faded autumn colors. You're getting a pop here. Yeah, we're going for it. And again, there's something for everybody. If you like something a little more muted, that's available too. Um, but we obviously want to bring in some wow. Great. All right. Well, this is once again gorgeous. And all of these flowers, you service the Home Depot stores, yes, right? So you. we can go to a Home Depot. Yep. And all of this up. is going to be in your indoor garden section this time of year. I'm a big fan of Bell Nursery. <laughs> Thank you so Thank much you. for joining us. And if you want to learn more information, log on to our website, foxbaltimore.com slash more.